if only there was a road map, if only there was evidence-based information about how to help someone move from active addiction to long-term recovery. If we could take just a little, just a little bit of the guesswork out of how to help people. Well, I want to talk to you today about the evidence-based five stages of change. There's five of them. Here they are. Pre-contemplation, contemplation, preparation, action, maintenance. I used to tell people that pre-contemplation was a fancy word for denial, which was partly true, but not 100%. Pre-contemplation generally means a person in addiction doesn't admit it. They don't own up to it, and they don't care. Now, see, denial, if you, if you deny that you have a problem, that's denial, of course. But when you say, you know, I don't really want to change. I don't care if I change or not. Now, I'm going to give you an example. Uh, all of us, every last one of us, know someone who is a nicotine addict. C cigarette smoking. People who smoke cigarettes are addicted to nicotine. And a lot of them don't want to stop. So they're not going to stop if they don't want to. But often in a person's life, they move from active use, for example, with cigarettes, to thinking about it. And when they start thinking about doing something, that's called contemplation. That first shift from pre-contemplation to contemplation, don't downplay that because that is really the foundation that recovery is built on. When a person finally reaches a stage where they say, I want to do something, or at least they say, you know what, I might actually have a problem. So that's pre-contemplation moving into contemplation. The third stage is called either preparation or planning. And this is where you look at the information, you look at your own addiction, you see what's out there, and you start doing some research and figuring out a path to recovery. Preparation. Next is action. Now, action, one of the keys here is a lot of times people will say, well, I'm not ready yet, okay? Take action before you're ready. Start before you're ready. Don't wait until you're ready. If you wait for all the lights to turn green before you head downtown, you're never leaving the house. So you want to start taking action before you're really ready to take action. It, it means, in other words, get started. So we have con pre-contemplation, contemplation, preparation or planning, action. And then this is something that a lot of people don't get, they don't understand the importance. And that's called maintenance. The fifth stage, maintenance. You know, five, six years ago, if we had a person who was in heroin addiction, the first thing we did, the most critical thing we thought we were doing was get them into detox. Get them into detox. Okay, they're detoxed, but they're still addicted. So we had to come up with an action plan. We went, them in, we went into sober living or maybe a 30-day program. You do the 10-day detox and then a 28 or 30-day or 60-day or 90-day program structured to try to help them. That's part of that action phase. But then we get the maintenance. See, maintenance is where reality sets in. Maintenance is where the real world gets real. Maintenance is the tough part. Relapse generally just don't happen out of the blue. They are, there are a series of events that happen in our life that take us back to old habits. Maintenance is 
keeping away from and establishing new habits. And that's very important that we learn how to do maintenance properly. Now, over the next couple of weeks, we're going to be talking about each stage, each one of these stages, how to help your loved one to move from addiction into that maintenance, long-term maintenance stage. We're here on YouTube. We have a blog, Heroin Doesn't Care, no apostrophe, dot com or dot org. We have a Facebook page, Heroin Doesn't Care on Facebook and go to YouTube and become a subscriber to our channel and that way you'll be the first to know when each video is relieved. On Facebook, go to Heroin Doesn't Care and you'll like our page and you'll be updated when we release these videos. Subscribe, you'll be the first to know when each video is released.